Oh. Hey everyone, and welcome to our 24th episode of our Hogwarts Legacy playthrough. So in our last episode, well, we died. And it was very traumatic and sad. But that's what you do to not die. You don't fall off a cliff thinking, oh, I'll survive this little jump because I'm on story mode, and then die. That's, no. Terrible idea. I don't recommend. So, we restarted. We finished that mission. And now we're good. We still have a lot of things we have to do, so we're kind of just going to hop right into it, if you don't mind. Alright, so here we are. We just left Sorona's because we checked in with her and we turned in her her quest that she had us do to go meet Dorothy Sprottle. And now, let's see what else we gotta do. We had to meet Deke, meet Sebastian Fellcroft. We're not going to do that because we might die again. More moons, the tale of Roland Oaks. Let's go ahead and, and take care of that. Meet Adelaide Oaks. She's a Hufflepuff. So let's go meet her. She should be at Hogwarts. Yep. Yeah. Let's get out of Hogsmeade. I always forget that you can't fly in Hogsmeade. I'm just so used to hopping on my broom. Obviously not when I'm falling down a cliff. But if you haven't checked out the video, I recommend. Now it is nighttime, so we're most likely going to have to speed up time when we go talk to her. But that's okay. Avelio. There's still a lot we have to do. Got to collect some Merlin trials. Uh, gotta go like more field guide pages yep and she's not here yet she's not here yet so we're gonna wait for her hello Adelaide Adelaide Oaks isn't it I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. Bad what idea. with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumors that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? You should definitely be worried about your uncle, yes. I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's alright. I... Ugh. Could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. For sure, for sure. Has your uncle traded with many goblins? Yes, for ages. Even speaks gobbledygook. But he only recently mentioned... <sighs> Ranrock's lot. <sighs> Insisting the galleons were worth the risk. He does it for me. Between robes and supplies, attending Hogwarts costs a fair sickle. And besides that, Uncle Roland has expensive taste. He's sacrificed so much for me over the years. I promised him that as soon as I finish Hogwarts, I shall be the one taking care of him. I take it you and your uncle are close. We are. My mother died when I was born, and I lost my father when I was five. That's it. Uncle Roland's looked after me for as long as I can remember. He knows I get anxious when he travels, and that's why he sends me all the owls, to let me know that he's all right. I mean, at least he's doing that. He cares. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Yes, ma'am. Oh, All right. Uh, no offense, but working with goblins, like, with Ranrock, 
Um, it was probably his own stupidity. I can't I hope trust Adelaide's them. Adelaide's uncle Roland is all right. She seems very worried. Adelaide mentioned her uncle's camp may be near Brockborough, past the river. Revelia. just up here. Oh, there's a huge camp. Oh, I know this camp. Okay. Um. Uh oh, and look. Nice. was here with that Niffler, wasn't I? Yes, this is where the Niffler was. Niffy! pouch in there. There we go. Oh, three gallons. Wasn't it even worth it. Could this be Mr. Oaks's campsite? Yeah, but there'd be bad guys afoot. Revelia. What is... Oh, did I kill him? Ah, oh, maybe I did. Renrock's loyalists, just ahead. What have we here? Another human? And patrol. <laughs> like I ain't got nothing better to do. <laughs> I don't have anything better to do. Defeat enemy with ancient magic. Oh, well, that's all. No, 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 <laughs> Let's see. Who's that? Oh, I okay, now they're getting me. Now, to find out what happened here. Waiting well. I always try, because you never know. Roland Oaks map, okay. Adelaide said that her uncle kept notes Hate of his things. trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. I hate these maps. Roland Oaks journal. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Ro Ranrock's lot agreed to meet, but I do feel a tad uneasy. They amended their requests and were angry when I asked questions. I overheard some of their plan in gobbledygook. They're after my rare metal deposits that are suitable for drilling. I'm afraid of upsetting them further. They seem rather volatile, and I need this transaction to happen. Perhaps we can work out a compromise. Perhaps not. Roland Oaks. Hmm. Oh dear, Adelaide, your uncle got into some, uh, some deep trouble. Ooh, okay. Confringo!
Lumos. There we go. This looks intriguing. I love how this game, it goes to more of the lore of the world, because when you read the Harry Potter books, or watch the movies, I mean, let's go with just the books, okay, because the movies stick to the books, or are supposed to. You see, you learn more of the world, um, the outside world, than just the castle in this game. And I, what I really would like is there to be more opportunities, maybe for, like, um, in, in the supposed redo that they're doing of this, this Harry Potter series, I would like for them to go more than out than what's in the book. Go more into the material that we've learned since the the books have come out. I know it wouldn't be true to the original books, but I feel like if you have, um. J.K. Rowling's blessing, then wouldn't it be so grand to learn more of this world outside of Hogwarts? At least, I don't know, that's what I think. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Incendio! I die. No. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Sorry for that curse word. I, I apologize. I should not have. And I am so sorry. bodies in there? Okay, well, that should be enough to get up at least. Find the river again. Oh, okay. Am I being attacked? What am I being attacked by? Nothing now. Yeah, these are so easy to beat. Alright. Follow the river. Am I going the right way? Where are you guys running from? I 
think I'm going the wrong way. I think I need to go this way. Dale's not half as tough as it says. The Ministry ought to relax their feelings towards the Dark Arts. A rock formation. That's the first landmark on this map. Now, to find the crooked tree. And when did I set my traps? Was it lower or upper hops? Come out oh, before I find you. Admiral Trick. Uh, use the plus to launch an airborne enemy into the air. Okay. Um... Let's see. Am I supposed to be a I know a man in trial when I see one. I think I know this one. See those statues? Yep. I need to repair them. I don't have it saved on here. There we go. Repair it. So there's one. That's the other was behind that. And the other. Right there. Repair. And there's that. <laughs> easy peasy lemon Repair. squeezy. There we go. Gonna go in here because why not go into the dark, scary cave that had spider web all over it? Lumos. An already dead spider. Hmm. This is so scary after all, was it? Just as the map said, the crumbling tower shouldn't be far from here. No. I don't see no crooked tree. No. No. I'll say crooked tree, but that's all right. Hit a flaming spider to blow it up. Okay, well, I don't think. Oh, I did blow it up. Okay. Oh, this is one of those diving spots. Midnight 
debonair ensemble. Well, that's red. Lame. Okay. I'm just gonna believe the game when it says, oh, crooked tree. I don't see no crooked tree, but. Merlin Child. Oh, okay. I already see one of those flaming bronze uh, razors thingies. And the crumbling tower. Where do you the see spot crumbling on the map tower? should be directly south of here. Okay, this girl's seen things. Infringo. One. Two. Three. Bam! To be safe, so I think we need to go up there. Is that? Revelio. That was a chest. Oh, was it in the tower? Here I was so worried about the brazier. There we go. Green and red, worthless. This must have been one of those places. What do we have here? Explored. And how do I get up? Oh, I don't get up. Okay. There must be stairs. Slam a leaping loyalist commander to the ground. Disarm an enemy. Keep two enemies airborne. Hmm. Disarm an enemy should be the easiest one to do at the moment. Slam a leaping loyalist commander to the ground. Huh. Or maybe if I get him to leap. Hello, I'm right here. Get away! Slam, slam, slam! Did I do it? No. Okay. Come on, do it again. Oh, wait, no. Slam. No, oh, didn't do it again. How do I do this? Maybe I gotta do it when he's already like airborne. Okay, if this doesn't work, I'm gonna disarm him. One, two, three. Nope, didn't do it either way. I just killed him instead. Not what I meant to do. Anyone that is, but Rebellion. Do okay, disarm. Let's see. I can do that. Hello. Got you. Okay. Keep two enemies airborne. Hmm. Hmm. I may have more luck higher up in the keep. Two enemies here. Oh, there's a troll. A ladder. That's what I need. Rebellion. What I need is a loyalist commander. Man. They changed. How does he not notice me? I'm right behind him. And why can't I use Pertificus Totalis? 
to make it closer. Okay, well, he doesn't notice I'm here, so... <laughs> Level two, two enemies, and then hit a ranger with Stupefy. Okay, I need a ranger. What went on here? I Pavelia. It's chess. Is that on the inside? Did I miss it? I did. Shame on me. Unforgivable one. I'm probably I don't know. I'm I'm undecided on the forgivables, guys. Another chest. Don't mind if I do. Teal finger. And there's another chest, but I I don't know where it was. I seem to run. What was that? That's me going invisible. That was nothing. The wizards will be defeated. Right, hit a ranger with Stubify. That's a warrior. He got too close, guys. He got too close. I had to end him. Two enemies this like trouble. to be close together, or I need a ranger. Whoa, he just appeared out of nowhere. Did you see that? He just appeared out of nowhere. Uh, hit a ranger with Stubify. Okay, um... I need, I need, I need... Nope. Shoot me. Shoot me. Got him. <laughs> Levitate two enemies simultaneously. Glad I was never locked up here. Yeah, I need, I need, I need both of them to come. Only one game. I need you guys together. Come here. They deserve. I was right. You're nope, that weak did human. Nice try. Gurgling death sounds. Beauty to my ears. 
Okay. Now, down there, I think, is how you get to um, Roland. But I want to know how do I get to that troll? How do I get up? Okay, I think I need to take that. Rebellion. Enjoy Slam my leaping command to the ground. Yeah, but I need you to leap at me, buddy. One, two, three. No? Still didn't do it right. Ah, uh, oh well. Lumos. Revelio. Oh! One less human to worry about. Why do this love? Ancient magic focus one. Rebellious. Okay, that chest I want is down there. I don't like the looks of that encampment. Fighter troll. Complete the battle in one minute. Okay. Um. Maybe not. Maybe not. Four seconds to spare. Revelio. Alrighty. Guardian Leviosa. Now we can go back and rescue Roland Oaks. This castle's hiding all sorts of secrets. I'm never gonna trust falling ever again. Just saying. Just saying. Steal a loyalist ranger's crossbow. Who's it's that? punishment to us all to have that miserable human around. I need a ranger's crossbow. Let's see. There. 
Yeah, hi guys. Were spot on. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Technically, their blood's on my hands. Ooh. Yeah, but let's look around first. Revenue. to go there yet. Catch and throw a disarmed weapon. Human's word is worthless. This prisoner owes us the metal we were promised. They launch a burning enemy into another enemy with this ploso and hit a ranger with Semplify. Okay, well, Semplify might not be that hard to do. But the launch a burning enemy into another one? That might be a little hard to do. A burning enemy at another. A boiler door. How to open it? That one, admittedly, is going to be harder to do. Rebellion.
can't get those wigging welds. Those are all wigging welds, right? Yeah. <sighs> hmm. There must be a way. Hit two enemies simultaneously with Petrificus Totalis. Away! You can count on that. Petrificus Totalis. Uh, I had to do it together. Should have waited till they were like next to each other, but I didn't. Oh well, missed opportunity. Wigging welds, wigging welds, all wigging welds. And that's where we came, we we're going to come up. But we didn't, we took the long way. We'll get what we Forget. Launch an, another enemy with the post. So I could probably do that. And then slow a lawless assassin. Mm. Okay. Mm. And then this Purgit guy. Yeah, that makes it easier. Where's an assassin? Gotta get my eyes on an assassin. These are all. Warriors. Nope. You fight about as well as a puff skate. I need an assassin, okay? I need your assassin. No! I will make you pay. I need this One less human to That's worry about. about. Rolling Oak's wand. This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free. 
You mean he is here. Got it. Grab an all statue. Oh, that's cute. I think I was actually supposed to go in that door last. And that would make sense with the... Well, now he can set himself free. not getting anything good. Like, I don't think I've had gotten anything good recently. Okay, I'll help you. I wonder if Adelaide's uncle could be down there. I say, I let him two run in the cage. Okay. He'll soon regret not bringing us the metal he promised. <laughs> okay, I think the only way to get them together is to bring them to me. I have a brother who works at Green Cops. Hi, Hello, someone. Hi. Let me help you. Okay. Come here, come here, come here. You are Chase out to me, guys. Chase out to me. It's Sam. Come here, come here. No. I'll bury you. Stupid. Here it is. Come here, guys. Come here. Oh, I'm going to scare you. Dang it, I did it again. Oops, I did it again. No. How childish. Well, come to me, and I will make this easy and painless. No. Put me down. I would if I could, but. Yes! Okay. Alright, you guys can die now. And yes, I think it's hilarious. You'll make me what? You I'm sorry. You only have I, I miss that. to blame. I guess you won't make me do anything. Revenia. Your gear slots are full. Okay, Mr. Oaks, I'm coming. Can't you be a little more patient? Is this like supposed to hold a head or something? And anyway. Alright, Mr. Oaks. Hello? M Mr. Oaks? Yes, I'm here. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I have experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. Fortunately, I've already found your wand, Mr. Oaks. Oh, you found it! Pass it to me! Hurry! Before they come! I must get out! Hurry! My wand! Oh, thank you, Merlin! Thank you! Expensive taste indeed. You did it! Oh, you found my wand and... Wait, you're a student? 
Oh, we must get you to safety immediately. It's dangerous. No, it's all Duh. right, Mr. Oaks. I've dealt with these goblins before. Dear Merlin, you're either very lucky or very talented. The latter. Well, how did you find you. me? I'm a friend of Adelaide's. She was worried about your business with Ranrock's loyalists. Oh, she was right to be. I couldn't go through with the agreement, and when I told them, I ended up blindfolded and behind bars. Been locked in that infernal cell for so long, they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasting goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. Hmm. A reward for what I'd done, you could tell me the information. That would be a reward. Am I right that you speak gobbledygook? Unbeknownst to Ramrock's fiends, I do. I've always had an affinity for goblin culture. Knew I wanted to be a metal trader ever since I was a lad. It wasn't easy learning the language. It's, it's complex. And my memory's as weak as my knees these days. But after decades working with fine goblin folk, I grew fairly proficient. At least, I'd like to think so. You mentioned you overheard things. <sighs> Sad tale, really. I think I know where Ramrock's unfortunate vendetta against Wizardkind began. Although dragon breeding was outlawed by the Warlocks Convention of 1709, Ranrock stumbled upon an illegal dragon camp. He was young, found the creatures fascinating. He'd visit the camp in secret whenever he could, never making his presence known. After weeks of sly surveillance, he finally summoned the courage to speak to the wizard in charge. Ranrock wanted to join them and the creatures. The wizard happened to drop his wand. Ranrock saw an opportunity. He picked it up, went to hand it back as a, a means of introducing himself. The sight of a goblin with a wand sent the wizard into an instant rage. He beat Ranrock nearly to death. Ever since, Ranrock has despised wizard kind. Sees us all as cruel. I mean, I can sympathize. It was wrong with that wizard. But what's Ranrock's doing now is not good. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Mr. Oaks was lucky. Ranulph's so nice lot would never have freed him. That's it. That was the tale of Roland the Oaks. Roland the Oaks. <laughs> Roland Oaks. Am I going the right way? No. Because I can't operate yet. Alright, well. That was a fun little quest. Yet again, no main mission. But that's okay, it'd be like that sometimes, you know? And this one was actually a pretty long one. Considering it was just a side quest. It was a pretty long one. And we still have things to do for the next episode. So stay tuned for that. Uh, I think... I think I'm gonna actually <laughs> have to do some... I only have them two left! Alright, we'll do it next time, I promise. Alright, and with that, I'll see you in the next episode. Did we this entire episode just doing one side mission? Unbelievable.